The all-new Land Rover Range Rover in what may be the wine-growing regions of Sonoma and Napa, California can hardly imagine Rover getting any more luxurious. Then we sipped Cabernet on a misty vineyard hillside and sampled a precious new vintage car with driver, a Range Rover SV with signature suite. The range has always been a cut above, the redesigned 2023 model taking things to new heights. With an airline-style massage backseat, an electrically adjustable club table, laser-cut mosaic wood placemats, a hidden champagne fridge and British crystal flutes, this Rover fits into a much more expensive SUV than a Bentley or Rolls-Royce. Only this unrivaled Rover of taste looks so much better than a half-baked Bentley Bentayga or a musty Rolls Cullinan, and drives quietly. Of course, most Rover loyalists don't want to downgrade or so for the new version. And Jaguar Land Rover isn't going to abandon its customers who are simply successful versus the truly wealthy. So the Range Rover 2023 lineup stretches wider than the rolling green hills of Napa, for the standard wheelbase SE model with 395 horsepower, turbocharged inline 6 to for the long wheelbase SV with BM's 4.4 liter, 526 horsepower V8. Americans in particular would put a cork over the long wheelbase version of the LWB, which addresses Rover's old watchfulness, the lack of a three-row model that led many potential buyers to pack for a Mercedes-Benz GLS, BMW X7, Cadillac Escalade or other seven-passenger specialty. Stretching nearly a foot beyond the standard model and riding an 8-inch longer wheelbase, the version is expected to capture 40% or more of Range Rover sales. Americans like them big, so the LW models come in a five-seater layout with bonus cargo space and legroom like a limo in the second row or a seven-passenger configuration in a third row designed to accommodate a six-foot-tall adult. Personally tested and approved by this six-foot-tall scribe, whose head doesn't touch the headliner and whose knees, feet, and elbows have acceptable comfort. The power switch tilts and rotates the second row seats for easy rear mounting. With a smart touch, the second row seats automatically shift slightly forward when the third row motor descends or rises to ensure that the third row headrests can free up space, then snaps back into position. No more frustrating moments when the third row gets stuck along its axis, forcing to readjust the second row or bother with the headrests to complete the swing. That Jeeves level cost includes a new rover, along with increased athleticism and confidence on the road and the exterior and interior design that sets and raises the bar for the status symbol SUV. Rover takes the lead with its elegant, yacht-like proportions, including the presence of a long wheelbase limousine-like model, sure to be loved by billionaires or loyal drivers around the world. Rover claims the all-metal body architecture is up to 50% stiffer and transmits up to 24% less noise into the cabin. Using the accelerometer and microphone outside the car, Rover then channels noise-canceling frequencies through its 1,600-watt Meridian sound system not available on the SE model, but standard otherwise. The spectacular 35-speaker audio system includes the industry's first noise-canceling headrest speakers for the four main passengers. The flat surface and precision assembly contribute to a 0.30 drag coefficient, solid aerodynamic efficiency for such a boxy SUV. The impressive 23-inch alloy wheels are capable of filling the wheel wells. The Rover's floating and falling roof is laser-welded for a sleeker look, its high waist is perfectly finished and rounded where it meets the dark windowsill. The digital LED headlights have 1.2 million micromirrors that can focus on 16 objects. The flatter glass makes the pop-out door handles almost melt into the body. The taillights recess to light, a world's first, forming a glossy black graphic that frames the tailgate, then flashing bright red. 